the hot rods of kart sport, the open class final. Current 2NZ, Vicky Saunders off the pole and gets out to the early lead. Down onto the back straight, and this kart's just a little bit different. It's, a, it's unique in the way that it runs twin engines, two 125cc Leopard engines, one on each side of the car, and they're direct drives, so probably punching out in, a, in the region between 50 to 60 horsepower. Neil Reynolds just in behind there in the 33, another former podium getter in the Open Class New Zealand titles over the years. Vicky Saunders, the current 2NZ, you can see the yellow plate, number two there. Signalling that's where she finished two years ago at the national title where the Open Class was last contested. Jason Lee into the third spot in the seven, running the Beryl chassis out of Europe. We've got Namiga from Australia out in front, Marinello second with Neil Reynolds. Reynolds running out of the South Island. Jason Lee borrowing an engine for the open class. They did some damage to the 125 S engine. That engine is borrowed from Daniel Bray, who's actually not too far, far behind him. Well, Jason Lee was the top qualifier in open at the beginning of the weekend. But it's been Vicky Saunders who's dominated the heats and the pre-final. She has not been beaten after qualifying. Two young ladies out there, Melissa Urban in the 68, currently running fourth on track with Richard Vickers just in behind. And Melissa's brother, Ryan Urban, former national title holder in the 90. Those three carts as Vickers goes up the inside with a big late breaking move. Those three carts all powered by the CR250 Honda motocross engine. You can hear them shifting through the gears. No gear changes for Vicky Saunders out in front. Two engines on that car are direct drive. This is Mount Wellington's Richard Vickers. CR250 Honda powered Tony Kart, number 65. Melissa Urban and Ryan Urban. Another pair of CR250s running the Arrow chassis. So the family battle here for position. Ryan Urban had to start from the back of this field. Had a deflating tyre in the pre-final. He's been the one, along with Jason Lee, that's been applying the pressure to Vicky Saunders all weekend through the heats in the pre-final before his tyre problems. It's Richard Vickers now starting to make some gains on Neil Reynolds for second. So Vickers up to third. He's got by Jason Lee as well. Lee just struggling a little bit, running the 125 up against the big 250s. Saunders has got on away. She has got a big lead. That cart very, very quick early in the run as Vickers makes contact with the back of Reynolds. Down onto the first straight left-hander again, right in behind him, they get together. Melissa Urban's gone off as well, Vickers and Reynolds. Urban off into the barriers off the edge of the track. As Saunders continues to lead this race, red flag out on the racetrack. Those drivers in a dangerous position. Let's have a look at the replay. Well, it was Vickers that looks like he got it all wrong down the inside, ran up over the left rear of Reynolds. That fired them all off the track. Back to the restart with Saunders leading, but that gap has narrowed. Jason Lee right up in behind off the restart. Ryan Urban now up into third. Melissa Urban's able to make the restart. She's in the fourth position as Urban goes through to second on Jason Lee. Just caught Lee napping a little bit off the restart. Just before that incident, I was saying that Saunders is very, very good early in the race. And with that much horsepower going through the rear wheels, the car just looks to maybe go off a little bit handling-wise later in the run. And this is the biggest run of the weekend. It's 16 laps. Saunders and Urban. Urban sideways trying to get by the two. Down into the pit turn, Urban makes a mistake. Jason Lee slips up the inside to second. So that red definitely didn't help Saunders. That lead has narrowed off the restart, but Jason Lee now starting to make a run. At the current two in Z, looking to go one better. She wants the one on the yellow number plate. Vicky Saunders racing out of Dunedin. Twin 125s combination making 250cc on the unique Amiga chassis out of Australia. That car purposely built to run this two engine configuration. 
Ryan Urban and Melissa Urban battling for third and fourth. Ryan trying to come back at Jason Lee. Getting down to the business stages of this open final. Ryan Urban, fresh from his win at the Stars of Supercarts event at Laguna Seca in California back in November. One of the biggest wins of his career and he's won many New Zealand titles. But it's Vicky Saunders looking for her first, leading this open final. Young lady racing out of Dunedin in the deep south. And this will be a popular win if she can hold on for just another lap or so. Battles further back, Mount Wellington's Greg Kalura in the wildcard, running the RS125 Honda. Basically an old Grand Prix engine. Daniel Bray just in behind in the 62. He's been busy this weekend running three classes. And that's the battle of the Mount Wellington Club members as Saunders. Trying to hold on, she got a little bit of oversteer through turn five. Lee ranges up in behind. Looking for some opportunities to get by. Jason Lee applying the pressure to Vicky Saunders. Down out of the pit turn. Couple of laps still left to go here. Saunders holding on from Jason Lee. New lap record for Ryan Urban. 43.022. Took three tenths off uh, Jason Lee's lap record set earlier in the weekend. And we've seen this all through the weekend with new lap records in every class except the Rotex light class. Vicky Saunders just tidying up. She's a little bit smoother now. She's starting to get back away from Jason Lee. Couple of cart lengths in it. Looking for her first national title. Down through the pit turn in front of the club rooms. Checkered flag out. It is Saunders. Holds on to the win. Dunedin's Vicky Saunders with a very popular win. Jason Lee second. Ryan Urban third. Followed by Melissa Urban, Daniel Bray and Mark Sweatman. Vicky, congratulations. You said you're going to come here to win the title. You've done it. Yeah, really happy. I uh, don't think it's quite sunken in yet, actually. Um, it's a really long last few laps of that race. So, yeah. Bet you're glad, like you're saying, glad to see that white flag come up. Oh, was I what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You can take the two off and now you're number one. Yep, yep, really happy. Jason, congratulations. Second place, pretty eventful race. Oh, it was a pretty eventful race. It was pretty tough, too, driving against um, a twin and a 250 behind me. So, um, yeah, it was a good race. Yeah, Ryan, that was a pretty good race, especially on the restart. You got through to second. Yeah, I came off grid 10, um, worked my way through, and then on the restart, um, got, up, got myself up to second. Unfortunately, we'd, we'd made a change in the rear, put a harder axle in, it didn't work. So, you know, I couldn't quite push for the win, but I'm happy with the result.